Hello, people of the internet, and welcome to episode 2 of Becoming a Freestyle God. If you haven't watched episode 1, it's at the top of the description. But anyways, let's get to it. I've been practicing a lot of arrow left uh, in between the last video and this one. And I had this cool clip playing hoops with my friend. Uh, so, hopefully, the goal of this video will be hitting an air dribble, holding an arrow left the entire time. But anyways, let's do some rings, discuss some stuff. Play some games and see where we end up. What to pick? Uh, I think we'll play some rings three. So I decided to do the rings three today. The probably the most well-known rings map out there. If you haven't played it, you're missing out or you're playing on console. I don't know. Uh, but I found out that when it comes to uploading the videos, I'm going to upload them like every two or three days. So that I get two to three days in between the videos to make progress. Wow. I, I hope that makes sense. But like, you know, if I upload every single day, there will be such little progress each video. Um, that it will just, yeah, it will just be kind of weird. So I, th th that's the plan. Every three or two days. Uh, other than that, I've gotten a lot better at the arrow left recently. As you saw in the intro of the video, I uh, I hit a cool air dribble uh, bump play, holding arrow left the entire time. The only thing I don't like about Riggs map is the awkward camera angles. Like specifically on this one right here, where you drive off the ramp and turn around doing 180. It messes up your camera angle big time, but I guess when you get used to being able to do stuff without seeing properly what you're doing, it's not that big of an issue. But yeah, also, question of the day, what is your favorite Nintendo game? Uh, I said it on stream, most people said uh, uh, Mario DS, uh, Mario Galaxy, uh, Mario Kart Wii. Uh, I personally, I would also say Mario Kart Wii is a really go to one. Or basically the Mario Wii games in general, just insanely good games. Uh, and also, uh, I've, uh, I'm using the Octane. Uh, I usually use, the, like, I don't, I've been using, I used Octane last episode oh, two, but I usually use the Dominus, but I don't know, when you do air dribbles, using the freaking Octane feels way smoother. Oh, my best time on this map as well, uh, prior to doing this, was 11 minutes, and that's with me be, do, doing like 40 minutes of rings before I do this map, and I shattered that record today. I beat the map two times within 20 minutes, and the second time was 7 minutes and 38 seconds, which uh, the previous one was 11 minutes and 49. So, 4 minutes and 10 seconds quicker without doing 40 minutes of rings on the two other maps before doing this. So, major improvements are made. Uh, also, I've learned that one of the most important things about freestyling that my friend showed me is that instead of knowing how to do cool stuff, you need to know how to get the opportunity to do cool stuff. So one of the most important things to practice when you're trying to learn freestyling is how to basically turn any situation into a good setup for a trick shot. Basically what I mean by that is that you try need to try and be like more flexible and creative with your setups for your uh, freestyle thingies because the more setups you can create, the more freestyles you can do. And it's better than only being able to do it if you get a perfect wall tour, for example. Okay, hopefully you guys enjoyed that and agree with uh, the thingy majiggies. Also, remember to answer the question, what's your favorite Nintendo game? And if you don't have a favorite Nintendo game, uh, or haven't played a Nintendo game, what's your favorite game in general? Let's load into some games, see if we can hit a wall tour dribble holding an arrow left the entire time. And if we do, major success. And yeah, 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 look, I hit champ again. So yeah, I, I know it's Division 1, but yeah, champ! Bro, this map is badass, I have to say. Also, I should probably learn speed kickoffs. I don't know how to do them. Um, <laughs> oh, poor guy. So yeah, that game didn't last long. I was leading like 7-0 and then the, my internet went bye-bye and it ended up with me losing the game even though I was winning 6-0 and I got close to hitting a couple of air dribbles. But not that much I can do about it. Let's just play another one. Okay, so we finally found a new game. I had to wait for a freaking not allowed to play thingy. 
Oh, we at least gonna score. No. Um. Take a chilpin. No, I'm just gonna grab the goal. I shouldn't have done that. It was really boring. It was a perfect opportunity for an air dribble. I was kind of a clean touch. Not gonna lie. Oh. Oh, he thought the clitch was... Okay, that... Apparently for him, that was the cleanest touch in the century. What? New game. I'm, bro, I'm 30 seconds into the game and I'm already unable to play because my internet is not working. I don't know what to do. Okay, I'm going to try and play, play casuals. I don't know if it's going to make a difference, but I guess we're going to find out. Bruh. I don't know what's the point of playing the game. I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to upload this video because I've been trying to play 10 games and s 9 out of those 10 games, I just start lagging after 30 seconds and it's unplayable. So yeah, I kept playing. I've been playing for maybe 4 hours now, having every game crash within 30 seconds. I got finally one game where I got a perfect... Uh, World to air dribble setup after kickoff. Scored the goal, air will left only. But because my internet connection was so bad, and some craziness, blah 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 blah, happened while well, the video was. I don't know, but the video got corrupted. I, I don't know what to say. Four hours I've been doing, trying to get a perfect world to air dribble setup from a kickoff. I get one, and when I finally do what I'm meant to do, the f video corrupts. <sighs> uh, I give up. I give up. Uh, maybe I'm able to do it next video. But yeah, I thought even though you guys didn't see the air dribble in game, I'd just do one in a training pack until I hit one that looked like the one I hit in game. And it looked something like this. You see, I've made a lot of progress. It's just really unlucky that I only have a maximum of 30 seconds to do one until I get kicked from the game. So yeah, as always, we end up the video with the little training pack. I'm uh, really annoying with the internet issue. Hopefully it won't happen in the next video and I'll be able to fix it. It's just that I can't really just go to my wall and be like, hey, you tell you tell internet to be normal and he like okay i tell internet to be normal for you it don't work like that would be pretty nice if it did but yeah, i've improved a lot but sadly enough i didn't really get to showcase it in any gameplay because yeah i got 30 seconds to do an air dribble and then i was gone but yeah, uh, I think uh, I'm going to start practicing after we hit there we're left. The next thing after that is probably going to be ceiling shots and ceiling pinches. And after I've done like the basic air dribbling stuff, I think I should focus more on ground dribbles. Because I totally forgot those were things. So like ground dribbles, just basic flicks and like uh, doing ground dribbles while drifting the entire time and stuff like that. Leave suggestions. What mechanic do you guys think I should like try and learn? Uh, like, which freestyle mechanic do you guys think I should try and learn? Like, I don't... Maybe, I mean, it should probably be an easy one, but if you guys know, like, easy, cool freestyle mechanics that are like, hey, if you know this, he look more badass in game, put them in the comments below. But anyways, that's about it. So yeah, the video didn't go as planned, but I still had a lot of fun, and I'd still got to show you guys how much I've improved, just not how I wanted it to do. Yeah, like just uh it didn't just it didn't turn out perfect, but it turned out okay. So hopefully you guys liked the video. It didn't it was not the greatest I know, but still. Yeah, I tried my best. Not that much I can do when I crash every 30 seconds. But if you like and watched all the way to the end, you should like and subscribe. Share this with somebody else that you think would like to see this. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one where I'm hoping that I'm able to play games and not crash within 30 seconds.